Hi, I'm Nick Bonner with TreeStuff.com, and I've got Andy from Moje here, and we're looking at a burgundy lace Japanese maple. And as we were walking down the trail, first thing that we both noticed was that there's some tip dye back on this. Andy, what's wrong with this tree, and is it something? Is there something we can do? Well, as you know, uh, Japanese maples are uh, very sought after for their uh, beautiful, distinctive foliage. This tree is uh, just like our. Uh, are similar to our other Japanese maples with a really beautiful red uh, colorful foliage that uh, is very attractive. Um, unfortunately, we're seeing a little tip dieback here. And, um, you know, without doing a, a thorough investigation here, I would probably think that this tree might be suffering from some nutritional itch issues. Uh, we've had a lot of rain this year, and sometimes when you have excess rain, it can cause some pH changes in the soil and uh, not allow the tree to bring up the nutrients that it normally wants to take up. So um, fortunately, we have a couple of products that, that uh, we can use to treat this tree. And uh, normally you might treat this tree with a, a, a ground fertilizer. Uh, that would probably work in, in uh, normal conditions, but if you've got a lot of emphasis uh, rain or water like we've had this year, you want, might want to try some micro injections to make sure that the nutrients are directly into the tree as opposed to getting off uh, as well. Uh, I think this tree is a really great candidate for using our product Stemex. So as our shared customers uh, recommend Stemex to their customers when they're selling this work, what expectations should they go to the homeowner? What should the homeowner, who obviously cares a lot about these trees, these are beautiful part of the landscape, this is something I think people are really likely to see in their business. What should they tell the homeowner to expect after that Stemex subjection? Well, sometimes we also have a fertilizer on an insecticide line of uh, uh, micro-injectable products. Uh, those products sometimes can take months to years to really notice a difference. Uh, fortunately, with fertilizers, we tend to notice differences pretty quickly, and you'll start noticing changes within one to two babies. Oh, wow. So a customer might be uh, really noticing change of color, greening up, you won't see greening out a red maple like this one here, or a Japanese maple, but you will notice uh, uh, some uh, re weeting out and uh, basically the canopy filling back out of I think that's a great opportunity for people to build into their business and uh, really appreciate you sharing that with us. Thanks. Got it. Thanks, Captain.